So we have CAN and we have CAD and we have CNC. Are you confused? Don't worry, let me explain in this video. CNC and what CAD stand for, how they differ from each other, and the advantages and disadvantages that they bring. Welcome back to Design Technology On Demand. My name is Charlotte and I make weekly videos every Wednesday and Sunday helping you to succeed in your Design and Technology GCSE. If you haven't already hit that subscribe button, then make sure you do as it helps my channel grow. Okay, let's recap from last week's video where we looked at what is CAD. CAD stands for Computer Aided Design and it is the tool that focuses on the design element of the process. For example, the way it will look and how it will function. For more information, check out that video. Let's move on to CAM. So what is CAM? Without CAM, there's not much use for CAD. It's the next stage of the production. CAM stands for Computer Aided Manufacturing. It's the use of software and computer controlled machinery to automate a manufacturing process. You will need three components for a CAM system to function. Software that tells a machine how to make a product by generating toolpaths. Machinery that can turn raw material into a finished product. Post-processing converts tool paths into a language machines can understand. Let's think back to that CAD file. You will need to export it into a suitable file and upload it into a CAM software. Software will prepare your file into codes that will be able to control a machine like a laser cutter or an embroidery machine. The software's job is to calculate any errors that will impact that manufacturing process. It will create a set of coordinates for the machine to follow. It will determine the machine's parameters. For example, the cutting speed the voltage of power, the height of the material needed to be able to be cut through. So hopefully now you understand the difference between CAD and CAM. CAD is used for creating your design, whereas CAM takes that CAD design and prepares codes that will be able to run a machine. However, these machines are not just any machines, they're CNC machines. But what are CNC machines? These are complex machines that are computer controlled and provide a level of efficiency, accuracy and consistency. This would be near enough impossible to achieve if done manually. It stands for computer numerical control. These machines are controlled by codes which were generated in that CAM software. These codes are then programmed and control the movement of the machine. So let's focus on the movement. The code has generated some coordinates that will direct that machine. It will work off an X, Y and a Z axis. Last lesson, we looked at the laser cutter. So the Z axis is used to measure the height of the material and the laser distance, ensure an optimal energy density. Some machines will be automated, but some will have to be focused manually. The X axis will read from left to right, where the Y axis will go forward and backward. They work together to be able to follow that path. So let's simplify everything that we've learned so far. CAD is computer aided design. CAM is computer aided manufacturing. CNC is computerized numerical control. The X axis is left to right. The Y axis is forward and backward. The Z axis is the distance of height, so that is up and down. Are there any other machines? There are a couple of examples, there are so many more. We have the CNC milling machine, a CNC router, a CNC lathe, you've got vinyl cutters, you've got computerized sewing machines. So what are the advantages and disadvantages of using CAM? For the advantages, machines can be set to run for 24 hours a day, faster and more accurate than traditional machines, high level of performance for batch and mass production, and work off CAD files. For the disadvantages, expensive setup costs, training time needed, machineries need specialist workers to program and maintain machines, unemployment created to the workers as machines are replacing people in that manufacturing process. Before we end the video, let's make sure that we do fully understand everything. What was CAM and what CNC? CAM, computer aided manufacturing. CNC, computerized numerical control. How do they differ from each other? CNC machines need codes to be able to function. So CAM uses a software that generates these codes that will run and operate those CNC machines. But we also need the CAD file. The CAD file then needs to be given to the CNC software to be able to generate those codes. So they're all interlinked. You start with the CAD file that then goes to the CAM software that generates those codes that then allows the machine, maybe a CNC machine, to be able to operate. Let's end the video by you putting one advantage and one disadvantage in the comment box below. If you found value within this video, then please do hit that subscribe button as it does help my channel grow. You may also want to check out some of my other videos. See you in the next video where we look into the different manufacturing systems.